By virtue of authority delegated to me by the two governing boards, I now confer the following honorary degrees. The provost will introduce the candidates. High in the stratosphere, a thin layer of ozone gas circles the Earth. It filters out much of the sun's most harmful ultraviolet rays. Without it, life as we know it would not be possible. In the mid-70s, working with the chemist Sherwood Rowland, our first guest theorized that the ozone layer was put at risk by chlorofluorocarbons, CFCs, then a common ingredient in aerosol sprays, coolants, and other products. The discovery was a historic milestone in atmospheric chemistry. It foreshadowed the finding of a hole in the ozone layer over Antarctica. It led to a landmark international treaty, phasing out the production of substances that deplete the ozone layer. And it earned our guest a share of the 1995 Nobel Prize in chemistry. The first Mexican-born Nobel laureate in science, he has for decades continued to push forward the frontiers of environmental science at UC Irvine, at Caltech's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, at MIT, and most recently at UC San Diego. Beyond his research, he has continued to be deeply engaged with public policy, with special attention to air pollution in major cities worldwide. He carries out this work in part as head of a major center for energy and environment that bears his name in his hometown of Mexico City. It says much about him that after receiving his Nobel, he donated much of the prize money to create fellowships for scientists from developing countries. We honor Mario Molina. Guarding a sphere that encircles the earth, committed to the care of the air we breathe, an atmospheric chemist of stratospheric achievement, whose work in the lab is a boon to the world. Mario Molina, Doctor of Science.